Welcome back to the Discovery Channel. I'm Jack Tarpin with Great Main Adventures. Come in here and see this. Here we have the rare dead stump weevil. Okay, can you get a close shot of this? Mm. Now, this is interesting here. Here is their lair. Uh, I don't want to disturb them too much because they're quite vicious. Handy, handy over here, my sidekick. My assistant here is going to reach in there and try and grab a dead stump weevil. Go ahead, reach right in there. Hopefully it doesn't bite your hand off. <laughs> can, you, can you find it? No. Ah! Oh my, oh my god. Cut, ah! cut the camera, cut the camera. Okay, welcome back to the Discovery Channel. I am Jack Tarpin, your host of Great Main Adventures. Uh, my sidekick, Handy over here, <laughs> is not handy anymore. He uh, had his hand taken off by a dead stump weevil. Um, common to these parts in Maine. Uh, Peppy, the Captain Mushroom King here, uh, has absolutely uh, no purpose in this film. <laughs> Handy and I are going to go back here and see if we can find one of the rare wood heckers of Maine. Now, follow us over here. As you can see, we've set up a lawnmower sound. It's not a real lawnmower. It's just the sound. Woodpeckers are attracted to the sound of lawnmowers. Okay, up here, you can see they're very small. I don't know if you can get a shot of that, cameraman. There is the uh, woodpecker of Maine. Um, occasionally, these things fly down. They're very small, very hard to see, and they move very fast. Now, I would really hate it if one of them flew down and hit Handy in the head. Okay, can you get a close-up of that? Wow, very... <laughs> Ah! My head! Goodness gracious! Cut! Cut! Welcome back to the Discovery Channel. I'm Jack Tarpin, your host of Great Maine Adventures. Um, I'm very sorry. I'd have to apologize for that poorly dramatized uh, woodpecker attack on my assistant, Handy. Uh, you know, I've gone through several assistants, but he's probably one of the best I've had so far. Now, the next thing we're going to do, common to domestic Maine, is the lawn goat okay the lawn goat may sound very tame to you okay you may think goat lawn tame it's not however these are some of the most vicious creatures found in the main domesticated areas uh, the town of milo is extremely popular they lifted the ban on lawn goat hunting 50 years ago and uh, several were slaughtered. Uh, a few remaining ones went into the woods in hiding, uh, and then it became an endangered species. Uh, they put the band back on hunting, and now the lawn goat runs rampant through the streets, killing women and children, and it's quite sad. I'd like to see the band lifted again so we could slaughter more. Uh, they make very good barbecue meat. Now, in order to attract these lawn goats, the first thing we must do is have a decoy. Uh, Handy here is going to be my decoy for the lawn goat. What I want him to do is get down on all threes. Go ahead, get down on all threes. Now, be searching for the, uh, what you want to be looking for is the wood line, the lawn, and your decoy. Those are the three things that you want to have your camera pointed on because this is going to happen very fast. This is going to happen really, really fast. All right, now get down. Get down like you're a goat. You're a goat. Now, now do a ba. Ba. No, 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 no. More from within. Ba. Ba. You are a goat. You ba. are a goat. Ba. Ba. Keep going. Ba. Just don't stop. Ba. Ba. Camera. Ba. Now on the on the wood line. Ba. I hear some rustling. Ba. Do you hear that? Yes, I think ba. I do. Do you hear that? Yes. I hear rustling. Ba. Yes. It's coming. Ba. Ba. Watch for it. Ah. Ah. It won't be long now. Ah. They normally don't take this long. I want to, it's going to happen very quick when it does. It's going to be very, very quick. Ah. Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Welcome back to the Discovery Channel. I'm Jack Tarpin, your host of Maine's Wild Adventures. Um, we've just seen the uh, Maine lawn goat. Uh, it was a grisly sight. Sadly, these are all that remains of my assistant, Andy, uh, his bandage. 
Um, the lawn goat will go straight for a wound. What they do is they, they like to find prey that's been wounded already, target in on it, and drag it off into the woods. Um, we're not going to bother looking for him because he's probably been ingested by now. <coughs> Maybe later we can find, uh, if the lawn goat has defecated, we may be able to find some remains of Handy. But we're not going to put too much effort into it because I'll have an assistant next week and we'll all forget about it. Um, there's a shoe right there. I wish the goat had left the other one. This is a nice, uh, nice shoe. What was that? I hope that wasn't the main swooping crane. <laughs> oh, God. Run for your life! Stop Run! Stop! Stop! Water yeah. Yeah. That's all. Come on.